The North Carolina A&T community is mourning the loss of one of their own. Volleyball student athlete Fatima Shabazz. She died suddenly on Sunday. WFNY News 2's Jalen Gilkey spoke with the head coach about this tragic loss. Well, Shabazz, she was a redshirt senior from Cincinnati, Ohio. Saturday, during the Aggies Big South Tournament semifinal match, she suffered a medical emergency. Sunday, she unfortunately passed from a brain aneurysm. Head coach Hal Clifton spoke about her unexpected death. Oh, it hurts. Um, they're your family, they're your kids. Um, so you've developed these relationships with them and our whole approach to family is that, you know, these are not my biological kids, but they are my kids. The Aggies head volleyball coach said Fatima Shabazz was one of the best players in his 11 year tenure at North Carolina a and uh, She was a fierce competitor and that energy and excitement that she brought onto the court is just contagious throughout our team. During the Aggies Big South tournament match with High Point, Fatima unfortunately suffered a medical emergency. She later died from a brain aneurysm. And Fatima was a wonderful student and a wonderful person. And she was doing everything so well. She graduated with her undergraduate degree. She's in her master's program, um, bright, talented young lady. Um, so it, it hurts and it hurts deeply. Novant Health Neurologist Dr. Rashid Janjua explains what an aneurysm actually is. Some arteries in the brain can have weak spots and because of the pressure, those weak spots, just like a bicycle tire, if the outer tubing of a bicycle tire wears thin and the inner tubing can start pushing up, it can start forming bubbles and those bubbles can be weak and at some point they can burst, causing a hemorrhage in the brain. As the team regroups and prepares for their match this weekend, Coach Clifton has one more message for Fatima. And I'm thankful that I got to spend time with you. People were asking for a miracle. And when she passed, it wasn't the miracle that we wanted, but the miracle was that we were able to be with her. Coach told me that Fatima was one of the funniest players he ever coached, and that is how she will be most remembered.